Shout out to the WTC gang. We the chosen ones, baby. Never underestimate the chosen ones. You'll lose a real one for life. I need everybody to put in the comments below and say you done lost a real one for life. You see what happens when people underestimate the chosen ones? It's like we give people so many chances. We give people opportunities to be with somebody special like us. But once you underestimate the chosen one, you done messed up for life. Once you walked all over us, talked about us, mistreated us, you done lost a real one for life. And when I mean real, when you're a chosen man, I'm going to keep it real, man. We give the shirts off our backs. We will give you the, the last shirt on our backs. We'll give you the last meal on the table. We'll give you our last cup of juice because that's just how real we are. But not only as far as the giving part, but just everything in general, our genuine spirit, our vibe, our aura, our presence, our anointing, our gifts, our talents. Once you underestimate that, guess what? That's very hard to come across. Let's keep it real with the people. You might, you know, come across some real good people, but they're not chosen. When you come across a chosen one, you got to know within yourself, like, wait a minute. This guy is chosen. I don't know about Tyrone, but I know about Jordan. Come on now. This dude is chosen. I have people told me that I'm chosen in my life. Way before I really knew my calling and my true purpose. People used to be like, dude, you're chosen. I'm like, what are you talking about? They're like, dude, are you kidding me? Like, you're so chosen, dude. They're like, look at you, dude. Like, you're not even from this earth. I used to be like, what are y'all talking about? But now I see what they were talking about. Now I see what other people see. At first, I was blind. Now, I'll take that back. I once was lost. I need every chosen one to put this in the comments below. <laughs> I once was lost. Thank you, Lord, for bringing that back to my remembrance. I need every chosen one to put this in the comments below and say, I once was lost, but now I'm found. I once was blind, but now I see that I am the chosen one to be. Let me tell you something. Do not go back to people that underestimated you. Because of the simple fact, they had every chance in the world to stay with you or to be with you. Friends, family, loved ones, hubby, wifey, I don't give a damn who they are. If people underestimated you, I'm going to tell you how they're underestimating you. Number one, they ghosted you. That's the underestimation right there. This is what I mean when I'm talking about people that underestimated you. Number two, they're trying to find every little faulty, wrong reason not to fuck with you. You ever been around somebody and they're just looking at you like, hmm. They're trying to figure you out. There's something that's just not right. Or there's, it just, it's just like this is a too good, too good to be true feeling. Hmm. When they do that shit, guess what? They underestimated you. <laughs> Whether you like it or not. Right? And just when somebody rocking with you, man, guess what? It's going to come in clarity. It's not going to come in confusion. If something that's really meant for you, it's going to come at peace. It's going to come to you and say, what can I do to be of assistance to you? <laughs> understand, understand. It's not going to come in confusion. You wonder why people come into confusion? You wonder why people come coming to you in your problems with their problems? Because you allow them to. Instead of slow cooking these folks, you're like, you know what? Forget it. I'm going to look at their outer appearance. They look good. Huh? Let me give them a chance because, oh, they could be wifey or he could be hubby. But then when you meet these people, guess what? They're Decepticons. They're hid hidden skeletons in, in closets. Skeletons are coming out. You like, whoa, 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 wait a minute. That's why I say when you see people's true colors, man, you better believe them. You done lost a real one for life. Once you underestimated the chosen one, you done lost a real one for life, man. I'm just keeping it real.
Once you mistreated the chosen ones, you'd have lost the real one for life. See, when you're chosen, we don't forget, right? But we have a tendency to really just, just go on to a whole totally different new life. We have the audacity to just move on. We'll ghost you so fast, you won't even know that we, that we existed. We'll ghost you so fast. Because of the simple fact that you underestimated us in the first place. That's like a slap in our face. <laughs> because we already know our worth. We already know our true calling. And the simple fact that you underestimated us. <laughs> where they do that at? Huh? You don't do that to the chosen ones. You underestimate these Decepticons out here. These want to be chosen people. There's some people out there that really want to be chosen. You underestimate them people. Don't you underestimate God's chosen people. Because you'll lose a real one for life, man. So I hope everybody will have a blessed Friday, man. I hope everybody will have a peaceful weekend. As your boy just finished with the back to back to back. I will be back with more content, but I have to let you guys know once they underestimate you. Guess what, y'all Re have respect for yourself is what I'm trying to say. When you know people don't really fuck with you like that, have respect for yourself and just walk away. Chunk up the deuces and keep on pushing because God got something bigger and better in store for you, man. And never forget, if you need a friend, you already know you got a friend in me. If you need prayer, you already know you got a prayer warrior in me. If you need motivation, if you need inspiration, you already know that you got the best motivational speaker in the whole wide world. You know why? Because we the chosen ones, baby. Be blessed.